fueled by the misinformation of folklore and stereotypes fostered in hundreds of grade B horror films, perhaps no animals are more feared and misunderstood than bats. This is particularly true as it gets closer to the Halloween season and the images of black cats, bats, and other so-called creepy creatures are displayed everywhere. But keepers here at the North Carolina Zoo have put together a program to help people better understand bats and dispel some of the myths. Some of the common myths and misconception about bats is uh, that they get tangled in people's hair. They're actually going after the insects that are flying around your head. Another one is that all bats carry rabies. It's only about one half of one percent of all bats actually have the rabies virus. Now one other misconception or myth about bats is that they are rodents. They are closely related to primates. So the bats we have exhibited here at the zoo are the common vampire bat. They actually in the wild will lick or lap up the blood and they get that blood from a small wound that they make in the animal with their very sharp teeth. Well, Batology is a bat awareness weekend that was designed by keepers to teach people about bats and the benefits that they have to us in, as humans. We'll have a lot of information about bats. We will have bat specimens. We'll have examples of what bats like to eat. And we'll also have some activities for kids. Visitors will also have the opportunity to see vampire bats getting fed. And what we kind of like people to take away from Batology is one, the benefits that bats have to people, and we want them to come out with a respect and a appreciation for bats and the role they have in nature. If you'd like to learn more about bats or plan your visit to the zoo, please check out our website at nczoo.org. I'm Rod Hackney reporting for the Zoo Files, connecting your life to wildlife.